All right, guys, so now we're going to go and compare the four methods on how to combine data in Tableau, unions, joints, relationships, and data blending side by side. So let's go. The first point is in which page, in which layer we can use the method. Now, both union and joints, we can create them at the data source page in the physical layer. And as well, the relationship, we can use it at the data source page, but in the logical layer. And finally, the data blending could be used at the visualization level in the worksheet page. And the next point, can we use the method in order to connect tables from different data sources? Well, for union joins and relationships, we cannot do that. It should be done in the same data source. But only the data blending could be used in order to connect tables from different data sources. The next point is, after using the methods, are the tables going to be merged? In unions and joins, they're going to merge the tables and they're going to create completely new tables. But if we are using relationships and data blending, they will not create anything. The next point is about the flexibility. If you are going to use unions and joins, the decisions that you are making at the data source going to affect all the worksheets and the visualizations. But if you are using relationships and data blending, you have way more flexibility. For example, in the data blending, you can decide on each worksheet page. Now, if you are talking about the joint types, in joints, we have inner, left, right, and full. In the relationships, we can have as well exactly the same behavior as joints. But in data blending, it is fixed. We have only left join. And the next point, if you ask me to rank these methods, I would say, and Tableau as well gonna say, always use relationships. And after that comes the data blending. It is really great way on how to combine tables from different data sources and the flexibility that we have. And then the third one, I'm gonna say the joins. I would not rank union because it's completely different than the methods of joining relationships and data blending. So always try to go with the relationships. And now let's see the big picture on how those four methods works. And let's start with joins. They're gonna connect two tables at the physical layer and they're gonna create completely new logical table in the logical layer where it's gonna combine the fields of both tables. And then at the visualization layer, the data set is gonna create a query at the data source and data source is gonna get the data from the logical table. And same thing for the union, you can create it at the physical layer of two tables and they're gonna create as well completely new table where the rows of both tables is going to be combined and at the visualizations table going to send a query to the data source and the data source is going to get the data from the logical layer and now to the third method of the relationships we have two tables at the logical layer and tableau will not combine or create anything we are just describing the relationship between a and b and at the visualization level, Tableau gonna ask the data source and the data source gonna get the data from the separate tables. And finally, the data blending, we have two data sources. The first one gonna be called the primary data source. The second one is the secondary data source. So first, Tableau gonna send a query to the primary data source and then another query to the secondary data source. Here, it's important that the aggregation gonna happen before the data is combined and we are combining the data at the visualization level using data blending. So as you can see, joins and union happen in the physical layer. In the logical layer, we can do relationships. And at the visualization level, we can do data blending. All right, guys. So with that, you have learned everything that you need about combining tables in Tableau. And next, we're going to practice where we're going to create two data sources using the new skills that we have just learned. 